Hi there, once again welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's tutorial, we're going to learn how to create a custom arrows within Photoshop. So these are custom arrows I've created and I'm going to walk you through how to do this. But before that, remember to subscribe and don't forget to turn on post notification so you don't miss any of my upcoming video tutorials. Okay, so this is what we're going to do. And even there are ways to add custom shapes in Photoshop, it's difficult modifying this arrow. So I'm going to walk you through how to do that. So I'll first delete the arrows I have on my display and then let's see how to do that. So in order to do or create arrows within Photoshop, we're going to use the line tool. So go to your tools and then under shapes, make sure you select the line tool. So after selecting the line tool, you have the options display at the top. I'm going to do a few modifications to that. So you can select the color that you want to use. If you want to use yellow, then I'll select that from the fill color and then make sure the stroke color is off. And we go to the path options, which is like a gear icon, and then you can set the size. Make sure the end is checked. If this is not checked, it's not going to work. So make sure the end is checked before you draw your line. So we're going to go with 90 pixels for the width, and then the length is going to be what 300. For the width, we're going to leave it as default. You can change it any way you want. So if you want to do a straight arrow, then I can just drag like that. And you can see I have the arrow head for that. And I'm done creating my arrow. But what about if I want to create a custom arrow? How do I go about it? I want it to look like a cave. How do I do that within Photoshop? So let's see how to do that. Follow the same process. Select the line icon or the line tool. And then we can now draw a different arrow with the same settings. And then we can let's change the color to a different color so we can see what exactly is going on. So now I'm done creating this, but I want it to look like a cave. So what we'll do is I'll go back to our tools and under the pen to select add anchor points. So make sure add anchor point is selected. And then before we add any anchor point to this, let's first zoom in on this. And then make sure the right, make sure the right arrow is selected from your layer. And then we'll go and then make sure we add an anchor point to wherever we want to modify this arrow. So I'll click here. And then I've added an anchor point. So I can start dragging that anchor point around to modify how this arrow will look. I can add additional one. And then I'll go ahead and then modify this arrow. So you can see how this arrow is being displayed now. I can easily modify this arrow. So this is how to create your own custom arrow within Photoshop. The steps is, are quite easy. Just follow the exact step to create any arrow that you want. I'm going to create the last one. Remember to like, subscribe, and also turn on post notification for more of my videos. We'll click on this, and then this time around, we'll draw a new one. But we're going to do modification to that. I'll select a different color. I'll use red in this one. And then let's also zoom in and then see how we can modify this arrow. We'll go back to the same process. Make sure you select the add anchor points and make sure the right layer or the right line is selected and you add an angle point. So I can do something like this. And also click and then do something like this so this is also a custom arrow i can just drag can do any modification thank you so much for watching this short tutorial like come away again bye bye